You might remember last week we showed you one of the most expensive PDAs out there, the new $600 Sony Clie. What if you're like me and a little more cash conscious? Well, Brett Larson benchmarks the new Toshiba Genio. You would be both. Uh, yeah, it's actually, it pretty much does everything you need to organize your life. And the best part, it won't break your bank. Missing in the pocket PC equation, inexpensive hardware. So far, pocket PC devices have cost upwards of $500, which keeps many of them out of the hands of consumers. Toshiba is breaking ground with the introduction of their E310, a pocket PC-based PDA that's also got a friendly price tag, only $400, plus a slick, slim design. It has all the software features you'd come to expect in a pocket PC device. Address book, date book, notepad, and to-do list, even solitaire. The display is an eye-pleasing 320 by 240 with 16-bit color. On board, you'll find it included 32 megabytes of RAM for storage, which isn't a lot, but that should hold you over. Should you need more memory, Toshiba includes a secure digital slot, which accepts the postage stamp size SD cards. That same slot will also accept expansion modules for Bluetooth, and a module for 802.11b is expected sometime in the future. There's also a three-way rocker switch on the side called the Toshiba Scroller for easy navigation through menus and applications. Tech TV Labs found the E10 online for $375. That makes it the least expensive pocket PC device on the market. I'm a handspring user. How does it compare to that or the Palm? It compared actually with the Palm M515 for the, as far as price is concerned, but mm -hmm. the Palm doesn't have as many features as the pocket PC devices. All right, so, Brett Larson, your benchmark. Thanks so much. You can up. find out more information by going to our website. You can even see how this stacks up against its competitors at techlive.com.